I think it's important to know that family businesses outperform non-family businesses by almost uh, 2x. However, very few family businesses enter the third generation. Much of the perpetuity problem, if I may call it like continuity problem or intergenerational transition problems are caused by poor family governance and bad relationships. In a nutshell is what makes family businesses highly risk prone while their rewards are very high. In Parampara, what we try to do or what we shall endeavor to do in the days to come is to make a difference to all members of family-owned business. In India, 65% of uh, India's GDP is contributed by family businesses. Perhaps about 47% of employment also comes, is generated by family business. So family businesses are critical factors of socio-economic development, the economic development of India, as they are globally. The vision of Parampara is to build family business perpetuity through strong family business values, family relationships and family governance. In a nutshell is what we wish to do. So anything that we contribute in the sustenance of family-owned business from generation to generation, advancing towards the third and fourth would make a difference not only to the families but also to the economy of the country. The mission of this institute is to focus on family businesses in India. Emerging family businesses, smaller family businesses, businesses that are in tier two, tier three cities. That will essentially be our focus, but of course we will address any family business that needs our attention and is willing to work with us. What we expect to do is work in, uh, in, in four stages. Of course, once again, our focus is family business. So with each family, we will try and take them through four stages of maturity. They have the option to drop out at any time. However, where we'll start with creating awareness, then we educate them. In education, we go deeper, wider, and it's typically done for the entire family. And then we develop them, we adopt them, and hopefully over a period of time, we will partner them in a way that helps them perhaps write a family constitution, create a family code of conduct, family values, understand their parampara, and bring it forth into their business. Legacy tradition is the hallmark of any family business, hence the name Parampara. Parampara is a not-for-profit organization and uh, it's essentially a social initiative. We at Parampara have created four verticals to enable and achieve this mission of ours. So of one vertical is will be dedicated completely to reaching out to emerging family businesses tier one cities, tier two cities, wherever they are. We reach out to them and we have reached out partners who have kindly agreed to work with us to do that. The second is, uh, you know, as we reach out to these family businesses, it's important to create a resource pool that will help them. This resource pool has to be certified, it has to be trustworthy, and it has to be extremely competent. So we need to create family business advisors in this country. And this is what Parampara will do. We will go out, look, select high quality people who have a sense of commitment to family business, pick them, train them over 11 months or more uh, through assessments, through projects and so on, and ensure that they will handhold emerging family businesses in a confident, competent and trustworthy manner so that they can take this message across and work meaningfully with several families. Research and case studies, primarily focusing on Indian case studies. Today, most of the research available are international research, very good ones, but they still are not Indian. And we need to bridge that gap. So we, they're going to dedicate one vertical to writing case studies, doing research on Indian family businesses and bringing it forth in our teaching. So it, it will be a practitioner's view and it will have a teaching value to it, a teachable value. The third vertical focuses on events and conclaves where we want to invite members of family-owned businesses to meet together, to share their experience and share their experience with other family businesses to make a difference to them. This is an exclusive event that shall be taking place by invitation. And the last vertical is to ensure that entrepreneurship is kindled and the fire of entrepreneurship continues in family-owned businesses.
the spirit of family businesses is enshrined in entrepreneurship because that is a lifeline that's a spirit we want to dedicate a group of talented people who will work in building family entrepreneurship in the center work we are going to establish a center of excellence which will ensure that generation after generation entrepreneurship and unless we can ensure its continuity from generation to generation perpetuity remains uh, structural not the essence of it uh, gets lost so we want to focus on entrepreneurship family business entrepreneurship and hopefully all of this will add up to ensure that we have a stronger more vibrant economy as we go forward and we believe there is a purpose here there's a mission here and we wish to bring in all our expertise into this uh, we have a panel of ex experts who work with us they're international experts they're indian experts they're people who have been in family businesses written family constitutions have actually had experience they've all agreed to work with us the best of lawyers the best of teachers the best of professors and uh, case writers and research so to do this we have tied up with uh, best in class global partners and i'm sure you'll hear more of that as we go along thank you remains sustains and contributes towards the growth of family owned business we look forward to working with you